press the like button if you love Red Wings with your heart. Hey, Red Wings fans, it's that time of the year again where we dive into the stories behind our players' jersey numbers. And today, we're unraveling the tales, inspirations, and even coincidences that have shaped the numbers on the back of those iconic Red Wings jerseys. But before we get into it, if you're enjoying our content, please consider hitting that subscribe button to stay up to date with all things Red Wings. We're also eager to hear your thoughts on these jersey number stories, so feel free to share your opinions in the comments. Inside an NHL locker room, there are countless stories to be told. Some of these stories are right there on the backs of our beloved Red Wings players' jerseys. These numbers are more than just digits, they hold personal significance, memories, and meaning. Let's take a look at a few of them. Ali Mata, number 2, Mata wore number 2 during his junior career, but it was already taken when he joined the Pittsburgh Penguins. So, he ended up with number 3. Sometimes, a number just feels right. Justin Hall, number 3, Hall's connection to number 3 began when it was assigned to him for his first NHL game. He liked the idea of continuity and decided to stick with it. Single digits are special, especially for an original six franchise like the Red Wings. Ben Kyarat, number 8, Kyarat had been number 7 for the longest time in Winnipeg. When he moved to Montreal, the only available single digit was 8, so he made the switch. Sometimes, jersey numbers just choose you. Robbie Fabry, number 14, Fabry's choice of number 14 doesn't come with a detailed backstory. He simply wanted a change from his previous number 15, and 14 felt right to him. Andrew Kopp, number 18, Kopp's attachment to number 18 started during his first two years at Michigan. With number 9 and 19 already taken, he saw 18 as the next best option. Austin Zarnick, number 21, for Zarnick, number 21 was given to him. He usually wore number 27, but this time, he went with the number handed to him. Sometimes, a number just ends up being your lucky one, it's these little stories that make our Red Wings players even more relatable and endearing. Each number on those jerseys carries a piece of the player's history and personality. As we cheer for our team, it's fun to know the stories behind the numbers they proudly wear. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel to stay connected with the latest Red Wings updates. We also want to hear from you. What do you think of these jersey number stories? Do you have a favorite? Let us know in the comments below.